having past experience definitely helps. Um, you kind of know mentally what you're looking for. You're not really as worried about the little nuances that you could face going into a championships, going into races. This is still another learning experience for me. I'm still learning every single time I'm out there on a championship stage. And so eventually trying to learn more and more, uh, working up until Tokyo 2020. Well, today I got block starts, um, trying to work the acceleration part of the race, the very beginning, trying to be as fast and as quick as possible, uh, while also still being able to be long and strong and setting up for the rest of the race. So um, every race features a block start. So, I mean, it's a pretty integral part of the race. So. Well, I think the biggest thing for him is really his kind of mental approach to things. He's able to handle a little more training volume, a little more intensity, things like that, which are, are really great. But probably the most thing I'm most proud of him is just the kind of the person he's becoming. It's really been neat to kind of see him develop into the man he's becoming. I think that's just a uh, big testament to his family, kind of his upbringing, his community at Otsego, his community here, his community at Mount Union, kind of have just all helped see him and help him progress and grow up. Um, but yeah, college season went absolutely incredible. I'm so excited to get back with those guys, but got a little bit of business to take care of here soon.